up gamers welcome to the channel for another Grand Theft Auto 5 online video here on my channel and as you can see yep I am driving a modded cop car and in this video and down in the descriptions are links to some jobs that you guys can be bookmarking here on PlayStation that are going to be getting us some modded vehicles and I'll be talking about the fact that we're not able to save a lot of these vehicles because well any of these vehicles because number one they're going to be hosted in a job and number two like all these are emergency vehicles if you guys weren't around for year one or you don't remember you just weren't here or something like that because well, this is like 10 years ago <laughs> So, it's quite a while ago, but in year one, if you guys did not know, we actually were able to get emergency vehicles. I can distinctly remember having, like, uh, as many garages as you could have back in the day, which I think was only, like, three garages or something like that. You can only have, like, three 10-car garages, like, in year one. Um, but, yeah, I remember a lot of those garages being full of modded... You know, anything you can think of, modded cop cars. We had, like, modded cop cars sitting on dollar dollar rims, you know what I'm saying? Because we could take those vehicles and we could put them inside the LS Custom Shop and modify them. So the first vehicle you guys can see that we're going to be checking out here is going to be the ambulance, which looks like it already has green green windows uh doesn't have f1s yet so in the beginning there i did choose a vehicle that i'm gonna go ahead and merge this with and just like all of these jobs which are just made in creator so i think anybody can just go ahead and make these type of jobs it's not that hard so it's a stunt race i believe so right here you guys can see that i was able to actually hold on this is quit flashing here so it does have like a, a livery. I mean, obviously, this whole this whole truck is like has a livery on it. You can't really change that. It's gonna be kind of like the lifeguard truck or something like that. And since this is an emergency vehicle, unfortunately, there's no way of saving this. But you guys can see right there, it looks pretty dope with the. Uh, I put the white F ones on there with the uh, the red, the red other stuff kind of goes with it. I thought, yeah, I think it looks actually pretty sick. Right there with the F1s. Kind of a little bit hard to notice unless you actually really looked at it, I think. I mean, even if you were just driving this around, you'd have to, like, tell people probably, like, Hey, look at my wheels. They're F1s. But, you know, once again, that's only in a job that can hold two people, which I'll be talking about that more towards the end of the video when we get to the cop car. All right, guys. So, next job here that you guys can bookmark is going to be the Avenger job, which we're going to be checking this out. Now, I already have myself a modded Avenger. So, we're just going to be, like, modding it again, I guess. So, we're just going to go ahead and go through here. And then, just like always, we're going to be picking the vehicle. So, we have to have a modded vehicle. All these vehicles right here, I do not own them. These are just, like, stock vehicles. So, we got to find one of my modded vehicles. Whoa! Monster truck. Wouldn't that be dope if we could put monster truck tires on things? Like an Avenger? <laughs> That'd be so cool, right? Uh, hold on here. We gotta find one. We're gonna run out of time, maybe. Or maybe not. I don't know. Yeah, I think I'm gonna- I think I'm on a timer here. Hold on, I gotta hurry up and find one. Uh, there's a modded one. Uh, there's a modded one here. We'll use this one. It's got green F1s and stuff like that. It looks pretty dope. This is actually the new, uh, off-road truck. So, this is, uh, this is my original, like, modded one that I had for a long time. It's got binnies on it, as you can see. It's got the Skulls livery on it. Or, yeah. Benny's rims and skull livery some sort of modded white not really sure it's got some sort of undertone on under it as well and we got to hit this first checkpoint real quick and then I'm just gonna go ahead and hold down the triangle button to respawn and then when we respawn we should have all the modifications BAM there we go we're coming hot though oh man look at that so we were able to transfer all of the modifications once again gotta remind you guys I'm in a job right now like I'm in a race I'm in a stunt race right now and I cannot save these modifications and if you're like wondering how did I get my Avenger modded in the first place from one of the many many merge glitches that were in the game and uh, potentially there still is I don't really know I'd have to look so you guys can see right here got the F1s on here was able to was able to merge it it looks pretty cool. I mean, at least you could come in here with a friend. I mean, one friend. But once again, like what I said in the beginning, this was made in Creator, I believe. And whoever made these type of jobs, you could easily, like, recreate them and make them yourself. But maybe think about putting it to more than just two players so you can invite a whole heap of people in here like me 
when I have a whole bunch of subscribers and we all like to come in here during live streams and mess around and stuff, but only two people can come in. It's kind of messed up. All right, guys, so the next one that we are going to be looking at is going to be the police SUV. So I know you know this one because you've been chased by it a thousand times in the game, if not a million. It's usually got the dudes hanging off the side of it. So that's it right there. That's just the regular vehicle. But we're going to be merging this. And once again, all of these uh, jobs will be linked down in the descriptions below. So you guys can go down there and check that out and bookmark this. Uh, should we use this one again? Uh, we'll use a different one. Hold on. Yeah, we'll just use this. Uh, mm, which one? This one? We'll use this one. All right, we're going to go ahead and use this one. Oh, man, that thing looks pretty shiny. Just got it waxed. All right. So once again, I got to jump over this thing, and then I got to go ahead and hit the uh, whatever it is. I got to hit the uh, checkpoint right here. There, there you go. Now we just respawn. Respawn. See what it looks like. Oh! Hold on, quit flashing! Quit flashing! Oh, it looks sick! Oh, that's so cool looking. I wish I could save that too, but I can't because it's an emergency vehicle. We were only able to save emergency vehicles in our garages in year one, 10 years ago. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, Rockstar patched that glitch a long time ago. And it's really stupid that the fact that, you know, the game is this old. They haven't introduced any type of mode that we are we get to become police officers or they haven't introduced anything beyond what the game is. Like, they haven't even put in, like, a zombie mode or something for Halloween, which... I thought that they would end up doing it at one point, but hopefully maybe for GTA 6. Maybe they're saving a zombie mode for GTA 6 Halloween or something like that. Cross your fingers that that's going to happen. Let us know down in the comment sections below. Dude, this is the dopest one, right? This is my favorite so far. Look at this thing, dude. Oh, this is clean. All right, guys. Uh, next one is going to be Taxi. So, taxi is, I believe, something that we get to keep in our garage. I do have a couple taxis that are modded. Or merged, I think. Not the regular ones, though. Maybe not the regular ones. Oh, yeah, because they're both Pegasus. Oh, yeah, you can't merge Pegasus vehicles and save them. Yep. Dang, that's another thing that they fixed a long time ago, too. I remember that when they fixed the Pegasus thing. Can't save Pegasus vehicles anymore. I actually remember when they did that patch. That sucks. All right, so this is a really weird looking gray taxi right here. We're gonna merge it. Look at this, it's got like police tires on it or something. This looks like one of those like, uh, you know, the undercover vehicles, but it's not, it's a taxi. All right, respawn. Let's see what this thing looks like. Bam, oh yeah. Quit flashing. I don't know why it does that. Actually, I do know why. Look at this thing, dude. Modded taxi. Oh, let me go park this in my garage right now. I'll use this for taxi work. You know, another thing that I wanted to talk about is when I'm doing these merges over to these uh, emergency vehicles and stuff like that, not only, like, every modification is transferring, so even the engine modifications are transferring too. So when I'm like driving one of those SUVs around like I was do doing earlier for just a minute because I was having fun because that thing actually was upgraded, you know, transmission, everything on it, fully upgraded. And then it goes a lot faster, uh, just like the next one that we're going to be talking about for the police car. And then once again, it's unfortunate that the person that made these uh, only put it to where there's only two, but they can easily go in and update them and and change the amount of people that can go in you just put it to max so you know everybody can go in here and start merging and just run around and stuff like that and modded you know kind of like some sort of rp thing but you can't you can't do anything yeah it's really unfortunate too that we're not able to save any of this stuff so like this one right here this is the cop one uh i'm not sure if i have the link for this this might be down in the descriptions below but yeah, this can hold like how many people? This can hold like eight people or something like that. So you could probably make this to where it even holds more people. Because if these are stunt races, you guys know stunt races can hold 30 people. 
So why not just make it like 30 people? I mean, if I was going to be making these type of jobs, I would just do that. But that, you know, that, that's all that's all I would say about that. All right, guys. So we're going to merge this cop car with that purple modded, uh, whatever it is. Can't remember. Oh, Banshee. Yeah, I think it's a Banshee. Some sort of Banshee. So once like all we, oh, it's already got like a purple on it. You guys see that? Oh, it's already got like a purple on it. Look at that. Hold on now. We got to get these F1s on there though. We gotta hit the first checkpoint, and then we gotta respawn. So here we go. Bing, bang, boom. Yeah! Even though it's got flashing, stop the flashing. Oh yeah, look at that! That's Officer Gravesite in his modded police car, pulling you over in an RP server or something like that. I should be getting more in some RP, I think. That sounds like fun too here on the channel. Dude, look at this cop car though. It's completely modded. We got F1s, we, and it's got a skin, or uh, not like a skin, but it's definitely got like this uh, police livery on there. Just like I was mentioning earlier with the emergency vehicles, like the emergency vehicles, like no matter what, will have like some sort of, I don't know, some sort of like livery design on there, but I don't think that you could probably end up taking off necessarily. I mean, you can see this thing though. It's like really purpley green because those are the the chameleon whatever that I that I had on that car that I transferred over to it. But totally awesome. Once again, you guys, if you're like wanting to do this and do some merging and run around, you know, Los Santos and just see what a cop car would look like if you guys have never experienced this before and you could just do it for fun with a buddy or something like that, hit that like button on the way out, subscribe for new content, links are down in the descriptions below. But anyways, from there, you guys, hope you enjoyed the video and you're having an awesome rest of the day. Thanks for watching. My name's Gravesite, and I'll see you in the next one. So, peace.